Okay, my beautiful riders, what is going on? Long time no see, baby. I need for y'all to go ahead and smack the like button for your girl. Okay, I'm gonna need one of my riders or maybe two of my riders. Y'all go ahead and send me a um a super thing so y'all can help natural um get her meet her meet her goal for the month, y'all. Go ahead and drop down, drop your girl the super chat. Drop me a cash app dollar sign chat eighty one cash or you already know just like and subscribe to the channel. Okay, now it's been a it's been a long time, y'all. Well, it ain't been that long. I just feel like it's been a long time. And Charlie, show there's a whole lot going on. I will tell you this. I know that my subscribers like when we talk about Miss Days. I'm tired of Miss Day. Now, child, you know what? We're going to talk about Miss Days because I know that, you know, my people like when we talk about Miss Days. You know, y'all like. And so this is one thing that kills me about Mrs. Days. She wants to try to make it seem like it's a whole different reason why everybody talk about her. She said she had the nerve to say in one of her videos, y'all, that she was um, an originator. She had the nerve to say that she was creative. And that's why everybody comes to her channel. That's why she's a YouTube celebrity. Okay, and everybody can't get enough of her, honey. She said she is the originator, honey. She said she is very, very creative. <laughs> and she know a lot of people mad about it. Okay, I ain't this woman said, how many times we gonna keep hearing about the same, same song? Now she back all on YouTube uh, com complaining about YouTube. I'm so sick. How you keep complaining about the hand? How you keep throwing the hand that feeds you up? But she ain't gonna be um she ain't gonna be satisfied until they snatch this channel. I don't see how dumb a person can get. She's supposed to be trying to stay up under the radar. Now she on the video talking about how YouTube is just allowing you know um certain channels to um cyber bully her. She's been cyber bully. She's claiming that um you know it's been years um and that you know people are stealing her content and. I mean, Mrs. Days, she got her um her knees in a bunch, don't she? I mean, she constantly, if it ain't the haters, it's the ops, it's the T channel. I mean, this woman, she's just always focusing on the wrong things. She focused on the wrong things. That's why she ain't never got nothing going on and don't nothing never work out uh, you know, for her because she always got her attention focused somewhere that it need not be. You know what I'm saying? So she's mad with YouTube. Then she had a nerd to do another video. After she just got done cussing these folks out, and you know, you know the YouTube guidelines. It, it, you know, they don't, they don't want no cussing. Like, you know, I mean, if you say one cuss word, they're gonna automatically give you a yellow money sign. So that's why sometimes when I drop a video, y'all get the notification for the video. But then when y'all go to try to find the video, it's not there because I have to unlist the video until until they do their um. What you call that? They're, uh, you got to request a review for a human re review. Because when they first review the video, it's bots. Like, it's just like an automatic thing that, um, like, if they pick up on any cuss word or anything, they're going to automatically throw you in the yellow. Okay, so, boom. Once they do that, you got to unlist your video for them to do the review. So, that might take, okay, so say if I drop a video 5 or 6 o'clock in the evening, um, whatever, and they give me the yellow sign. Well, they'll take, you know, review... And they will monetize the video. They give me the green sign at probably about five or six o'clock in, in the morning the next day. So that's when I will go ahead and drop the video. Or if you don't, if you keep the video like it is, honey, they'll be done. Let you get all your views, and they'll take two days to request after they, you know, to do the human request, and then they would determine that it's suitable for all advertisers. But by then, you done got all the, the views you was gonna get for that video, so you ain't really getting paid for that video. So that's why I'm just, that's a, you know, a tidbit for my riders when y'all see I drop a video and y'all can't find it. That's why I just know that it's going to drop. You know what I'm saying? I just need a minute. You know what I'm saying? So my, my point is, you know, Miss Dash is just always on here. If, if it ain't one thing, it's another. If it ain't, like I said, if it ain't the ops, you know, it's it, the, the police even after her, honey. You know what I'm saying? The police even be taking time, honey. They say, they say, hell, I ain't, we, uh, we ain't going to Dunkin' Donuts, honey. We about to sit around there by... And what Miss Days would think the humpback be at, honey. That's where all the action at, honey. That's where the slope party at. We want to go around there about the slope party and then investigate and see what we can see. And fight a little bit of crime. You know what I'm saying? Around there about the slope. They say, screw everything else, honey. Ain't nobody got nothing else going on. We'd rather be around there about the slope. 
You know, like I said, Miss Daisy is just delusional. I mean, there's everybody out to get it. The police is on payroll. They taking time out of their old busy schedule. You know what I'm saying? To go see with the old Miss Daisy. I mean, I, she just get more and more delusional every time I see her. Okay, so last time I seen y'all, I think it was around about the time where she uh, was in the hospital. And she went to the hospital because of her sciatica. I don't believe, is Miss Days taking um uh prescription drugs? Is she just trying, is she doing one of them old prescription drug scams? You know what I'm saying? Because this sciatica um situation, I feel like, okay, now you, especially how you um explained to us that you got, you, you said you was having SEX. Adrian, ain't nobody got no sympathy about your sciatica, your niatica, your nirvana, your, your, honey, we don't care nothing about none of that. We don't care. Nigga. <laughs> You said how racks be, you know, how you turned every way, which way but lose. Well, hey, that sounds like a personal problem, sciatica. You know what I'm saying? Sciatica sounds like a personal problem. So then you was at the old hospital. You talking about some how you was about to go to the, soon as quick as you leave the hospital, you going straight to the, po the police station. You going straight to the police station to report, report, and fly, 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 report. We'll poke and fly, fly, fly. You know what I'm saying? And fly, fly. Hey. So, yeah, that's what you was supposed to be doing, honey. Everybody, honey, go take cover, honey. And take cover. Explain, uh, plan your getaway. Start to, uh, you know, mark your blueprint. You know what I'm saying? Call your folk. You know what I'm saying? You gotta you gotta you gotta get your escape route together, honey. Cause Miss Days just said, you remember how they say uh, back in the day the uh, slaves they used to braid the pattern like the slaves used to braid the hair patterns, uh, to, cause so they know which road to go down. Child, you better get your pattern. <laughs> cause Miss Days is sending people your way, baby. All the T channels, all the content creators. Yo, count your day. Count your count your days, cause Miss Days said, you know, our, our days are numbered. Now, like I said, I don't consider myself a T-channel. I don't feel like I do my commentary like anybody else. I just basically be talking. I just be talking. I just react to the things that Mrs. Days put out here. And this is what I don't understand. You know, she always quick to be like, um, yeah, you know, this is my channel. I get to say what I want to say here. This is my truth. I get to tell my truth here. This is what I can do over here, dear. You know, this might deal. If you want to do what you do, start you a channel and do what you want over there. Okay. <laughs> All that, you know. So she tell people what to do, and then once they do it, she got an issue with it. Because we got content creators that out here that was once uh, subscribers, and they became content creators to rip her a new one, and she's mad about it. She seems to think that the reason why we watch is because she is creative, and that she beautiful, and you know things that it ain't. That's what she want everybody to believe. The reason that why everybody watch her channel. Miss Days, that's not that's not the reason why we watch you. You and then Miss Wanda, girl, we're gonna get into that. Girl, Miss Wanda, I wanna we that and that should be a panel discussion that me and Miss Wanda have. Miss Wanda, I wanna call you out on that. You wanna have a, a, a real, real discussion. You can drop the link, I'll hop in your chat, whatever. About we we agree to disagree. Miss Dazed is a train wreck. Wanda don't think, seem to think so. I feel like Miss Dazed is a train wreck, period. <laughs> I mean, what else can you call it? I mean, you can call it other things, but I mean, a train wreck is just the, the easiest for me to call it. I mean, give give me some other verbs, uh, adverbs, nouns. I mean, you know, whatever. It could be called a lot of things, but she is a train wreck at the end of the day. In my opinion, everybody's entitled to it, you know, but I, I agree, I disagree with Mrs. Wanda. She said that she wasn't a train wreck. Oh, whatever. So, yeah, she ended up talking about that old sciatica. So, then, yeah, so she said she was going to go and file a police report and how everybody needs to be tucked and, then, you know what I'm saying, peeking around the corner or whatever, because Miss Days, what you going to do? Honey, yeah, that's what Miss Days had said, honey. And who worried about it? Who worried about it? you can't stop nobody from talking what they going you can't stop nobody from commentating and speaking and saying what they want to say about now I understand okay if you got an issue with um people playing your content whatever and at the end of the day I don't me personally I don't care about that because if I wanted to do that then I would because you ain't gonna do nothing and you don't know how to do nothing you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying you would have to have somebody else do it you know what I'm saying whatever but I'm just saying Miss Days you're not gonna do anything you can't tell people what 
to do and what. And I'm not really even speaking for um, everybody else. I'm speaking for myself. I'm going to say what it is the people like when I talk about you, regardless, contrary to what you believe, why I speak about you. You know what I'm saying? You claim I'm ugly. You say you look better than me. You can, girl, bye. Girl, bye. I mean, we ain't going to even get into all that. You know what I'm saying? But we're going to let you be delusional in your whole little world that you in over there. So anyway, then she had she would start talking about um, Mr. Rax. And she starts saying how... And, you know, I can't, I'm not saying it verbatim because I can't really remember. And, and you know, I can't really keep up with Miss Days. Miss Days don't be talking. It's like, at this point, her voice is cringe to me. Just her, just looking at her, just the way she looked, the way she licked her lips. Just the, she, the way she, she just, she just, ew. Okay, that's just the whole, uh, ew. She's ill. okay, and I'm sick of her. I am so sick of her, I don't know what to do. But anyway, yeah, she was claiming how she, um, pretty much saying, in other words, how she was, um, uh, pretty much sick of the, and tired of the situation with Rack. She was pretty much tired of being in the dark. Um, she mentioned something to the effect that, uh, he'd be weird at night. She, uh, <clears throat> noticed that he was creeping around in a dog. She said something about how that got to be a mental issue. This, that, and the third. Honey. So then she come back in another video. I think, I guess she realized that she had said too much. And she didn't, really didn't want to give us that information. But then she had, and then I, don't, I don't know if I'm jumping all over the place. But y'all know what I'm saying. She had mentioned something about, in one of them videos, you know, she do so many videos. She said something about um how Rax was drunk. And he had mentioned, honey, uh, yeah, because you can get your stuff or you can get out. You can go your separate way and I can go mine. I'm thinking to myself, okay, that would have been my cue to start making some type of move. Once he would have said that, you know, it would have versus me worrying about the T-channels and what everybody else is saying about me. I would have been worrying about where me and my cat was going to go. I don't reckon you're going to have to put them old um, lunch boxes to use. You know, you claim you went over around there about the Dollar Tree and got two lunch boxes, ain't it? That's probably about all you need to pack, your little belongings. You and kitties belong of the gings. You know, what you got to uh, put a scoop of kitty litter in one of them. You, gotta, you know, you got kitty a skip of, and then you put, uh, what, two or three catnips. I don't even know what cat, but yeah, two or three cat, two or three treats for old kitty. Mm-hmm. An old piece of balled up paper, because you know, and so you can throw that old kitty around about the curb. Yeah, that's kitty's bag. Boom, he ready to go. All you got to do is get you about five or six of your Timu dress, dresses. Go to mama. I know she got a vacuum pack. <laughs> vacuum pack about six or seven of them up. Boom. Grab you a can of sardines, a pack of crap. You know what I'm saying? Baby, you ready to go, honey. I don't want to see you and Kitty around there about the curb with y'all lunch boxes, man. See, but like I said, you got your priorities because you had mentioned you said that you was gonna start. Yeah, you was gonna start to get your um your own little uh room, and then if he wanted to come, he can come. But you had to figure out what, you know what was best for you and Kitty. I'm like, okay, you know. So then I guess he uh after he told you what you can do as far as packing your things and going your own separate way. I don't know. I guess y'all had some old. Type of sexual encounter, honey. Because you had to change your heart. Then you was drawing there hollering, talking about uh, how you back in love with your man. And how he don't want to let you go. And how y'all going to work it out. And you wanted to leave, you know what I'm saying? But you decided that, you know, you going to stick it out with your man. And how he found y'all a beautiful home. What in the house he found before that ain't got no, that was all in the dark, beautiful? We still don't know how beautiful it is and neither do you. You got to see to know how beautiful this thing is. You know, you've been telling us about you've been telling us about this a beautiful home the whole time. And we ain't seen paradise nowhere. You can't even see how beautiful it is. Can't no man tell me, honey, I'm about to go and get us a beautiful home. And then as soon as I get in there, I can't see it right. I got to. Nah, Miss Day. You thought you was really so like I said, you need to really hold. Hold it down before you start bragging on what y'all got going on, honey. Because you are... Then she gonna lie talking about some both of them was on the lease. Now, we all know Miss Days can't get nothing in her name. Where Miss Days don't the lease that, huh? You got to do a... Like, Miss Days, you're not on the lease. 
You're not on the lease. You're not on anything. She said she, she claimed she was going to pay half the rent. You know what I'm saying? But like, like Miss Day, listen, Miss Day is to be in, 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 in another room or another corner or somewhere real, real, real soon. We're going to see how this play out. We're going to see how this play out. You know what I'm saying? Love y'all. Till next time. Peace.